everyone! Hi Playbill, it is Betsy Wolf and that's me! I am currently starring in Anne's Juliet on Broadway, but today is not about that because today is all things... Hey, it's Betsy Wolf again. Betsy, why are you taking over the Playbill Instagram account today? Um, for one simple fact, I am obsessed with the musical Ragtime. When I was a... <clears throat> A wee child. Ragtime came out and I, like every other normal human on this planet, sang every single song in my bedroom. I acted it out. You better believe I was on my hands and knees doing singing your daddy's son. And my first trip to New York City as a kid, I'd already I already knew I wanted to do Broadway. Um, on our first trip, we saw four shows. One of them was Ragtime. I grew up um, just about 40 minutes away from where Audra McDonald grew up. I actually ended up studying with her same voice teacher and I was determined to go and see Ragtime. And here is photo evidence. This is myself and I am in the red dress. Just, well, we can talk about that later. We can, yeah. Okay, I'm not harping on the dress too much, but I would like to draw attention to the fact that there are banjos on it, um, maracas. It and I just want to say to all of my supporters out there on the Get Betsy 2 Ragtime campaign, Big news. I can think of something. I don't know. So yeah. Okay, so when I was So the reason why this whole concert here I am at the This one's the lead. Wait, say that again for the camera. Obsessed. Obsessed. <laughs> I 
think they were talking about me. Obviously. Obviously. Hi everyone. I just wanted to show you, here's the stage. And these are the stairs that I'm probably going to um, run up when I need to take over for someone. So. Okay, say that again, Lynn. Say it again, Lynn. Betsy, just for the ragtime, 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 ragtime alto line, you, I mean, I don't know why you're not on that stage. You should be. Listen it's to it. Listen to that. That's right. Ragtime. Ragtime. <laughs> Okay, this is unbelievable. He got the ticket. <laughs> I got the ticket. Do you remember the guy with the sign that I posted? What's your name? Eric. Eric. Eric got the ticket, and he's going to be in the third row. Eric, I'm so happy for this journey for you. Thank journey you. on, Eric. Journey on. What's your okay. By my calculations, it is only going to take me about seven seconds to run to the stage should I need to go to the stage for any reason. Anyone, if anyone can't make it, it's only gonna take me six seconds to get up those steps. I brought heels that have a nice, nice, like, heel on them. Hi, okay, so um, I am in intermission for ride time and I'm sure you probably were like not expecting this but um things are about to get really real because um I just like I have to share this side so obviously this all kind of began like as a fun joke right like get Betsy to ride time um but the truth is is like I can't even pretend that this is not like such a profoundly um, transforming life experience. I saw the show when I was 15 years old on a family trip. My mom and dad and sister and I um, flew out from California and I knew nothing other than like, I thought I wanted to do this for a living. And part of it was because of um, the profound way that stories could be told. One of them is this musical by Linear and incredible book by Terrence McNally. And um, the thing is, is theater speaks to people and the story and the importance of telling a story like this and the way that a story can be told with such um, profoundly moving and meaningful lyrics and um, stories is why I do what I do now. And um, to be able to, you know, have seen this at age 15, and then 25 years later, to get to be on my night off from a Broadway show and get to just look up on that stage and see people that in, they have no idea in ways that they um, made me who I am. And I would be um, amiss if I didn't mention Marin Maisie tonight, who, I know it's like just like completely shining down looking down on this old cast and Kelly is just like oh Kelly is just so beautiful up there um but theater matters and um truly it's like such a gift to be able to see this and to know that I had such supportive parents who who um just supported me and like even let this all be a possibility so shout out to mom and dad who um, maybe you're watching um i will go back to being like you know funny and cheeky about this whole thing but um i just like wanted to share from the heart like how incredibly important theater is and stories are and your unique story and um to be here to get to see this is like um, freaking amazing. It's amazing. Yes, I know him. Um, Michael, you just asked him, I don't care. And I found that so offensive. Okay? Michael Arden. What is this for? No one's okay, Michael. No one's it's okay. For? It's for Playbill. You were on Playbill. Oh, no.
the beginning. Stage, original cast member and current star of Funny Girl. Wow, Leah. Leah. We are, we are not doing well. We are not. Unwell. We are not doing well. I'm like actually legit unwell. So, uh, Betsy, you just asked me, how are we doing? I'm unwell. We are not doing well. We are. We are big fans. I was a big fan. And fans. absolutely emotional. That we, took we, me back. we both we remember it when we saw the show and where we wanted to be, and here we are. And the fact that we get to be in in this audience today is nothing but a blessing mm -hmm. and an honor, and to stand on the shoulders of these people who did this show so that we can now do what we do. It's a blessing. It is true. And, um, I'm emotional about it. I, I will say this. You know to give. I'm going to put the link in there. Put the link up. Donate, please. Because that donate. helps all the people in this business to do this because you never know what the next generation will be. And this show... Do I want to talk? Do I want to? You the Broadway show. You know you got the budget. Just I'm buy it. Just buy it. I'm buying everything. Do we want a sweatshirt? What do we want? I have to buy everything. Wait, hold on. We're after the show. And you are Alex. Alex just came up to me. He's been following along the ragtime journey. Yep. What did you think tonight? Amazing. 24 years of making money, so. I mean, epic, right? How many times did you cry? Multiple. 73. Lovely to meet you. Thank you for being here. I'm doing a video. Okay, I am here with the casting director, Arnold, who 
who saw all my tapes. I did. I watched them all. And um, ultimately, it's just that you couldn't decide what to use me for. That was the thing. Yeah. Because we had the 57 people. Yeah. Uh-huh. And, and then there were the 57 roles you could do. I know. And the actress one said I they know. couldn't do an additional performance. Yeah. So it kind of short-circuited itself. So yeah. it's, it's definitely our loss. Well, thank you for watching all of my tapes. I, everyone. Love I can't everyone. wait to be in the 50th anniversary reunion concert of Ragtime. Forward. I'll be in the back of my walk. I can't wait.